Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about the Earth and the length of its days over history. So please like this video and subscribe to the channel. And for more videos like this, also watch my other house channel, ANA Snakes and Stuff. My youngest son's channel, Henny's Toys and Games, or my oldest son's channel, Little Chris Tan. Now let's dive into the video. Earth's days used to be five hours shorter and it's predicted to continue lengthening over time. Once every 24 hours, Earth completes one rotation on its axis, marking one day on our planet. This reliable rotational period is what allowed humans to develop systems to tell time and what signals to humans, animals, and plants when it is time to rest. But Earth's rotation hasn't always been so consistent. In fact, a long, long time ago, Earth's day was much shorter, said Sil Sarah Millen Hallard, an associate professor of physics at MIT. The Earth has experienced days that were both shorter and longer than it is now at different points in history, Millen Hallard told Live Science in an email. Most importantly, it was affected by tidal interactions with the moon about a billion years ago the length of day was only about 19 hours early in the planet's history earth's rotation may have even been shorter than 10 hours constantine bad again a professor of planetary science at Caltech told Live Science in an email this speedy rotation was the result of a huge moon forming impact with a Mars sized protoplanet that accelerated Earth's angular momentum while breaking off enough of the planet's surface to form the moon. The moon's tidal effects eventually worked on the earth to slow it back down, Bennigan said. Earth's day has even been longer than 24 hours, Milhallen said, although only by a few milliseconds as a result of substance changes to the planet's moment, molten core, oceans, and atmosphere. Earth's rotation is actually evidence of its planetary origin story, Milhallen said. How quickly a planet rotates is determined by how it was formed when dust, rocks, and gas that circled the sun in a protoplanetary disk came together in space. Actually, how forcefully these pieces collide helps determine a planetary body's angular momentum and how quickly it spins. You can think about it like a spinning bottle. The more force you apply, the quicker the bottle will rotate. If Earth had formed closer to the sun, a planet's rotation would look very different, she said. In this case, Earth might have become tidally locked to the sun, similar to how the moon is tidally locked to Earth, Milhallen said. If Earth were closer to the sun, it would experience stronger, tighter interactions from the sun that would make the rotation period the same as the orbiter period, meaning that a day could last a year. She explained, Many exoplanets are thought to be tidally locked because they are very close to their host stars, Milhallen said. These planets have a permanent day side and night side because only one side of the planet is facing the star at all times. Earth's day is still changing. While the length of Earth's day might seem consistent to us, Batgallon and Merlin House said it's actually still changing in particular. It's lengthening a bit very slowly, about 1.7 milliseconds every century. The change in Earth's spin rate 
is happening gradually enough that evolutionary processes can adapt to the changes over time. Batigan said, the relative change in orbital speed would not be noticeable in daily life. Several factors are contributing to our slowing rotation. The primary culprit is our planet's relationship with the moon. Batigan said, Batigan said Tighter forces from the moon, the same kind that tug on ocean shorelines, are creating a fraction effect as the moon slowly distances itself from Earth over time. Indeed, that process will be extremely slow. It could take 200 million years for Earth's day to reach 25 hours. In the meantime, another, other planetary and astronomical events could affect the length of Earth's day. Milhallen said, for example, more commonplace events such as earthquakes could also have other smaller effects on its rotation. Unexpected collisions with asteroids could also change the length of the day. For example, by applying torque in the direction of Earth's rotation to make it spin faster, Milhallen said, for instance, the magnitude 8.9 earthquake that struck the pan on March 11, 2011, accelerated Earth's spin, which shortened the length of the 24-hour day by 1.8 milliseconds. Human-made disasters are another possible factor. Climate change could also play a role due to redistribution of Earth's mass due to the glacier melting, sea level changes, and terrestrial activity, Milhallen said. As the polar ice caps melt, the rotation is slowing down. Thank you for watching this video and peace out till the next one.